Change crankset on Canyon Inflight CFSL7. Currently bike has a 40 TSRAM quark crankset direct mount. Is it possible if I install a different brand's crank, since I need to install 48T chainring which I'm not able to find? Enter image description here. It looks like your bike has a quark prime alloy crank. The picture below is a shot of the crankset from behind the drive side arm, where the spider attaches to it. Enter image description here. This appears to be a crank that takes a separate spider, which mounts to a splined interface by the crank arm. The pic above is a shot of the reverse side of the drive side prime crank arm. The question is, does that spider have a standard bolt circle diameter, e.g. 110 mm? If you currently have a standard 110 mm spider, then you can actually buy the chainring you linked in your comments, mount it on the crank, and then lengthen your chain, which will probably require you to get a new chain. Presumably, your bike didn't come with the excess chain length. You can certainly install a different brand of crankset if you want, but you will likely need a different bottom bracket. I think yours takes a PF86BB, and you will need to get a BB that accepts the type of axle you intend to use e.g. 30mm axle used by Rotor, Easton, many others, SRAM dub 29mm axle, Shimano style 24mm axle, etc. I don't really see the point if all you want to do is get a 48T chainring on there. It may be worth mentioning that going to a 48T chainring will get you very high gearing. I think it will be unsuitable for cyclocross or gravel riding. I'm pretty sure this will give you the gearing of a 1X road bike. I think that Aqua Blue, which was a professional road team running 1X gearing, may have maintained a unique chain for each front chainring they used on the road. If you are thinking of swapping back and forth between CX and road gearing, this might be worth pursuing. Last, some terminology. I think I've mostly heard direct mount in the context of chainrings that are made in one piece with the spider, and that mount directly to a splined interface on the crank axle. For example, with Easton or rotor cranks, you usually would buy the arms. With the Easton, you then get a direct mount 1x chainring, or direct mount 2x rings, and the same with rotor. Again, those are made such that the chainring is integrated with the spider. Direct mount would not be my first choice of vocabulary to describe your crankset, or a crankset in general. I think it applies mainly to the chainring plus spider combination. You have a detachable spider mounted to this crank. Confusingly, it seems like the Easton can also take a detachable spider, and then you can bolt individual rings to that spider. The Ta Carmina crankset only takes a detachable spider, and you can select a 110mm or 130mm BCD spider. You can detach the spider from your quark crank and mount a quark power meter spider to it, or you can take an Easton or rotor crank and equip them with a power 2 max unit, or, in rotor's case, one of their own units. Anyway, contrast direct mount chainring, spiders with the usual practice seen in Campagnolo and Shimano cranks of making the crank arms and spider in one unit, then bolting the chainrings to the spider.